Hello, my name is Gary Fuqua, my pronouns are they, them, theirs, and I am playing the baker in Summer Sox production of Into the Woods. Hi, I'm Madison Hotchkiss. I am the baker's wife, and my pronouns are she, her. Hi, my name is Mariana Davis, and I'm playing the witch in the Summer Stock production of Into the Woods. Uh, hi, my name is Avery Gwynn. I play the wolf in Cinderella's Prince in Into the Woods. My name is Tristan Aviles, and I'll be playing Rapunzel's Prince in Summer Stock's production of Into the Woods. Hi, my name is Carolina Mooring, she, her, hers, and I'm playing Little Red in this Summer Stock production of Into the Woods. Hi, my name is Tanner Rose, and I'll be playing Jack. Hi, I'm Macy Ladner, I'm playing Cinderella, and my pronouns are she, her. Um, I auditioned because I've already done the show, but I really wanted to explore a different role. Um, and I've always loved working with Summerstock. Yeah, it's my first show, and I just wanted to know what it was like to be in a musical, so here I am, acting. <laughs> I have always wanted to do Summerstock, and I've never done a show at the Ritz, so I'm super excited to be involved in my first Summerstock production. My personal favorite song in the show would probably have to be No More, solely because, like, I think that and throughout the show, you see the baker um, slowly become a hero, slowly become more into being a father, having father-like qualities, helping people. And at this moment, this is where like all that's gone. He feels like he has nothing left, and he's just being bare. He has to make a decision of whether he wants to continue pursuing the good or give in to the bad. And I think that's, that's why that's my favorite song. My favorite song is probably Giants in the Sky. I just find it really fun to attempt to do what Tanner does and sing it. <laughs> uh, my favorite song to perform is definitely Your Fault, um, but my favorite song to listen to would be Witch's Lament. Um, I think my favorite song in the show is probably Your Fault. It's just, it goes all over the place and it kind of shows all of the characters um, finally like giving into their worst tendencies in the end, all those four characters, um, except for the witch who <laughs> gets us in line immediately after. But I think it's a good showcase of like the musicality of this show, first of all, it's a really hard song, and the like energy that the show has. Um that he's beautiful. <laughs> okay. <laughs> My favorite thing about the Prince and the Wolf is they're so over the top that you get to be just as crazy as you want with it. My favorite thing about my character, Little Red, is just such a little spitfire. She's kind of iconic. Um, she just makes little jokes every once in a while, and she's really, for a lot of the show, the comedic relief, especially in Act 2, and I appreciate that. Um, my biggest takeaway is, probably comes from Children Will Listen, just be careful the things you say, because you never know who's listening, who's watching. Um, you never know how you could influence or affect that person. Um, to live in the moment and enjoy life as it is. I think I often find myself wanting more, just like my character, but we have a beautiful life where we are. Oh my god, is moment full of words? His moments, can I say moments? Because yes. there's so many moments. I mean, every scene is something different every single time. And in life, we all want that moment that we're searching for, but when we get it, it's like, what's next? Mm -hmm. So that's kind of the show. It's like, what's next? Oh, this? Oh, cool. Oh, they do that? Huh. So, yeah, work. If I could describe the show in one word, it would be complex. Goofy. It's a silly show. It's funny. If I could describe this show in one word, it would be hilarious. A classic. If I could describe this show in one word, it would be wild. One word to describe this entire show, heavy, definitely heavy. <laughs>